This is the tricky part. I am so scared. Oh my god. It was going so well. It looks so good. No. Hey guys, so I'm going to be doing a challenge where I only use my non-dominant hand for the whole day. Um, I'm excited to try and trick my brain into this, although I think it's going to be super tiring, but we'll see how I go. So I think on the title I'm going to put that I use my left hand the whole day, but just to explain, um, basically I write with my left hand and I do most other things that are not like pencil-like with my right hand. I'm just going to be switching them. So you know, things like brushing my teeth, I'm going <laughs> to go with my right hand and I'm really scared because I think toothpaste is going to go everywhere because it's an electric toothbrush. I'm just going to swap and we're going to see how it goes. Maybe I'm going to find it super easy and just going to get through the whole day. But yes. What about you guys? Have you ever tried to like write with your other hand or like even just like brush your teeth with your other hand? How did that go? Did you? Was it easy? Was it really hard? I want to know. But yeah, let's get to it. I'll see you tomorrow morning. Good morning guys. Um, it looks really bright but it is still before 7am so kind of just wake up. And I'm going to start my day being left right-handed and being using my non-dominant hand. So let's see how I go. Okay, so I thought it was going to be simple. Um, but first thing I want is water. And I just realized I need to do that with my left hand. Yeah, my left hand. Okay, not too bad. This one's not too bad. Okay, now let's get my cereal and hope I don't pour anything. Oopsie. Okay. Just a slight rest, but we should be okay. This is heavy. So far has been really good. Mm. I just think it'd be so much harder. To be honest right now, I don't even know what hand. I think it might be my right hand that I don't use normally. It feels a bit weirder. Okay, now this is I think the real test. Let's brush my teeth. It feels so weird holding the toothbrush. I kind of already cheated as well. I was wiping down something in the kitchen counter and I think I just used my normal hand and I forgot. Oh. <laughs> oh Not too bad. Still weird. How <laughs> what? Oh. And I thought I'd do my makeup in front of the camera because right-handed makeup probably won't turn out so good. And also, I'm going to do eyeliner. I don't always put eyeliner, very rarely, but I'm not even good with my left hand using the eyeliner, so I don't even want to see my right hand. Oh my gosh, this is like scary. But I mean, even if this turns out to be like a super boring vlog, actually like switching up the hands you use and things is, like, is really good for your brain. Um, because you're so used to something, then it has to like recompute everything. I mean, I'm gonna find the actual science things and probably put it up here, so. But I'm pretty good, but it's, it is good for you. Oh my god. <laughs> okay, it doesn't look bad, but I'm poking myself harder than usual. Okay, it's a bit uneven, but I don't think you can tell. <laughs> anyway, this is the tricky part. I am so scared. Oh my god. Okay, I don't even know how to start. What? Do I? How do I hold this? Okay, let's do the side first. No. No. It was going so well. Oh. <laughs> that is how it looks. Hopefully it doesn't look too bad on camera, but it's pretty uneven. It's just more tiring than anything, using my other hand. I have to think way too much. And lastly, I'm going to put on lipstick. 
I'm choosing a very bold color so that you can see where I go wrong. <laughs> I overlined it by so much. Yeah, I don't even know how to fix it, but this is my makeup for today. On camera, I don't think it looks that bad. It's fine. Real life, you get up close, you see all the unevenness and bumpiness. You really need to pay really close details when doing these little things and that is really hard when I'm using my right hand right now. So I'm going to be doing a bit of relaxing um, to get my morning started right. And instead of like the colouring in trend, I'm using these like diamond paintings, I just call it that. but. There's like rhinestones and we're making like a cat and I'm scared because I really want it to look good But what if like all the crystals go onto the wrong things? I don't know. We're gonna try nope, nope, nope. <laughs> go. I'm actually super impressed that I'm doing well. I did not expect this at all so I act, it feels really awkward for me, but it's working. It's not even that much slower. So, yeah. Turns out I can do more than I thought I could. <laughs> okay, then we come to the boring bit, which unfortunately had no sound, obviously using my right hand and left hand switched um, made me lose track of details but basically I'm just working and then just swapped the mouse um, for my left hand and that's what I'm doing for most of the day I've just been working throughout most of the day and it was really hard because I kept kind of almost switching the mouse but apart from me super tiring wasn't too bad but what I'm gonna do now is write down a list of um, like a grocery shopping list but really it's for this video we're filming which is like weird food combinations so yeah we're gonna film tomorrow so I want to go buy them today so I'm gonna have to write the list using my right hand <laughs> okay so I've moved on to a desk to write this off okay let's do this so this is gonna take forever So I have my list now and there you go. I can like read what it says, but it took so long just to write a super quick list. Oh well, I'm just <laughs> taking my makeup off now for the day, again using my right hand. Okay, this one, yeah, this one's pretty easy as well with the other hand. Basically, I'm gonna keep this vlog really short because there wasn't much to it. And I thought it would be way more interesting to see. The only thing that I found was that I kept like almost switching and I had to remind myself like, oh, I'm carrying like my grocery bags on one side, like no switch. Or like, oh my God, the mouse has somehow switched sides. Or like I was using on my laptop the mouse pad more than the mouse because of like, I didn't want to use my left hand for that. So I had to keep reminding myself. So I think it was more just training myself and creating the habit rather than not being able to use it. And writing and things took just way longer. You know what, it turns out I found something I'm good at. I'm definitely not good at the kitchen, in the kitchen, but maybe I'm a bit more ambidextrous than I thought. Or maybe everyone would find this challenge easy. I don't know, please let me know. You know, if you were using your either your left or right, whatever non-dominant hand, do you think it'd be easy for you? Or if you do give it a try, link me. I'd love to see that you giving that challenge a go. It's a good night for me. And if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe and hit that notification button. I do post new videos every week. So I'll see you next week. Bye.